Enjoy Louisiana films, music, and more. Download the Louisiana Film Channel app now and let the bon ton do it. Hello again, dear moviegoers. Film critic Bill Arsenault here, and welcome to another Louisiana Film Channel Lanyap movie review. The, for the French Quarter, as it is now and as it always has been, is home to many an artist and shyster, young and old. From musicians busking on the curb to hustlers looking for that edge, there's a feel to the quarter that can't be described without using the word misfits. It is a location of nothing but misfits from here and from all over. They gravitate to its streets and alleys. Laundry Day, the French Quarter-inspired independent film, follows one day in the lives of four denizens of this part and party of the city. Titled after such wash and dry amenities at some of our eclectic bars, Laundry Day is quite the collage of a story. Two women, two men. One musician, one street artist, one drug dealer, and one skeezy bartender. All trying to catch a break one way or another. All points lead to a lo local haunt, of course, but the day as lived up to that point brings about many an individual and many a story. In the quarter, everyone is most aggressively an individual, and everyone has a story to tell. Laundry Day, from its main players to its quick appearances, including one by the late and great actor Michael Martin as a southern gentleman of articulate antiquity, is a day in the spirit of those who live hard in the Big Easy, but wouldn't have it any other way. After all, this is a place for misfits and mistakes. Vibrant, funny, and potent, Laundry Day gets right a specific community in a very specific place in a very timeless environment. Now the subject matter is primarily comedic, but things do turn to very uncomfortable levels towards the end with disgusting assault. It's a reality, unfortunately, but it's dealt with fairly and maturely by all involved, from filmmaker to actor to character. This is a picture of empty sex and heavy swear words, so be warned going in of its foul mouth and not so PG rated storytelling. I previously listed Laundry Day as one of the best movies of its release year, and I stand by that statement even as it goes through a re-release here in 2021. I highly recommend everyone catch it when you can. Now on the Gator scale, from zero to five, Laundry Day rates at a five. Thank you very much for watching. I was Bill Arsenault. Support Louisiana Film. Enjoy Louisiana films, music, and more. Download the Louisiana Film Channel app now and let's let's bon bon do it.